So what I'm thinking is that maybe I should go to Caldir next and save Primal. Usually you want to rush for Primal Kerrigan, right? Because she's just insane. But I was thinking that if we go to Caldir, we might be able to... Uh, we'll have plus two attack and stuff. It just seems like it'll be a little bit better. All right. Speak quickly. Oh, he's so big. Oh my goodness, look at that real scale Gorgon. <laughs> Wait, how do I zoom the camera out more? Okay, let me... That. Rescale options. Zoom only. There we go. Oh, I guess we're going in. There he is. <laughs> what a sick mission. Oh, I love it. I love the... I, I, okay, it sounds weird. I really, really love the just moving around targeting reticles. And it sounds weird to say it because it was my idea. But... Oh, it's so cool. It's really cool. It worked just like in my head. Okay. Let's get these upgrades. Let's do our best. Fire off some of these Scourge. We have a quick tumor by the first are there any other bases on this mission? I don't think so. There are a nightmare. Awaken. Annihilate that Gorgon. We blasted the Gorgon for the first time. Now we gotta, gotta get going real quick. I think I want to take down this base over here. It's almost always correct to kill that base. It's an annoying one. Unfortunately, we're kind of low unit density this time. Like, one base Zerglings is not really where you want to be. And I think this is one of the last one base missions in the campaign. Then we'll be good, right? Oh, hi. Kurgan's borrowed, right? Yeah, she is. It'd be really funny if Concussive Shells was one target with the thing, just like in multiplayer. It would be so useless. Alright, we're gonna nibble, nibble, nibble. We'll have to make sure to get those Kerrigan things. I don't really want to fight that. But I do want the money. Alright, let's go. I'm really torn between Zergling speed and Zergling attack speed, but oh, I don't know. Zergling attack speed just seems so good. Like, it's really the argument of, do you want to be able to get on top of the enemy faster, or do you want to be able to lose 700 Zerglings while getting to the enemy, but then kill them faster? And that's legitimately a tough question, I think. Is there a tank in here? I sure hope not. Yeah, there's a tank in there. Oh my gosh, that's... Hellion Hellbat Siege Tank. Oof. Oof. Alright, so uh, if I die, I'm starting to just have this sneaking suspicion that maybe the correct answer is to not attack into that. Oh, but it's, it's a base. It's a base. It's definitely correct. Oh, were they about to attack me? Ooh. Okay. So, I'm thinking that the six minute mark is what we want to wait till. Have the Hellions come out and attack me and then dive in. Once again, if I lose, which I won't. Ow. This is quite the choke point. 
Uh, I, I didn't... I didn't lose, I just, uh... I'm just reassessing the situation. <laughs> Jeez. Oh my goodness, that is so crazy. Thank you, Dan Dankin, for the subs. The eight tier one community gift subs. Thank you, Vixen Shy, for the subs. And thank you, Tad Pounder420, for the tier three sub. My goodness, thank you, guys. The Bone Trench. The Bone Trench. If this were in Warhammer, it'd be named after Jonathan Bone. Okay, we got We got to try this again. We're gonna approach it from a little bit of a different angle, and by different angle, I mean more zerglings. We definitely have to. <laughs> Can't believe <laughs> it's like two hell bats at one siege tank. <laughs> Everything is pain. It is unstoppable. Six minutes. Six minutes is what we're doing. It'll be fine. I gotta remember that little attack wave at the beginning. Get these upgrades going. Get my economy. And... Let's see. We have that. So you can be morphed into uh, Hatcherino. And I had three hatches, and it still wasn't enough, which is a little bit sad. Hmm. Where do we go? What do we do? This base does seem to be very important early on, though. Like, two bases on this mission is enormous. There's no reason to delay this, so we might as well just pop it right now. Slow down General Gorgfield. Each time a Scourge Nest is activated, the Gorgon's targeters are disabled and reactivate one by one over time. Gorgon's firepower also decreases. I mean, it's, it's still gone through a lot of damage. <laughs> I don't think the firepower matters that much. I have to avoid the circles. I might be able to run into circles at some point, but I probably should not tempt fate. They're not sending that early attack. Unless I already cleaned it up. I don't think I cleaned it up. Here it is. Hello, friends. Man, Marines suck. Like, look at how fast they die. This is why you should never even think about doing Marines only in a real scale challenge run. It's dumb. Zerglings are so much better. Zerg biomass, malleable sequences. Recover will empower Queen of Blades. Right, let's just pop on up here and clean these fellas out. Get my creep moving. So, uh, d okay, this is a, uh, I don't even know. Could someone, l like, did any, did anybody clip or anything me diving into that base or have the ability to go back and check? I know that Twitch has, like, somewhat of that ability. And I need to know how many Zerglings I ran in there with <laughs> so I can make sure that I have a lot more. <laughs> I was at 70 supply. All right, that is fantastic news. Because I am at more than that. I'm just going to open up this area. Remember, the six-minute mark is what we are waiting for. I'm going to lose a bunch over here to these areas, but it's got to be taken down. Oh, is that the Hellion attack wave? All right, I think it was. I'm just going to give this a quick save.
Oh, my zero goals. All right, we took it. This is the base. And we can blow up General Gorgfield. Oh, something over there is not happy with me. I think they have a siege tank. <laughs> Don't ask me how I knew. It's worth it. It's fine. You're one fine. of the bugs now, Kerrigan. I'll squash you. Need another hatchery. Five hatch, six hatch. Now, is the tank over here? Or is it, I bet it's like right here, and then this area is providing spotting. So that means that pushing into this area is, yeah, it's that bunker providing the spotting for it. So now I have the high ground which is fantastic. Uh, oh, no, 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 don't go there. I want to put it right here. That way I can spread as much creep as I can. There's the tank, 54 kills. We are well unsaturated. Uh, there's the targeting things. I hope that doesn't reactivate in a half second. <laughs> Sacrifice everything to kill this tank. Here we go. This area is looking great. Safety tumor. I may want to keep you near the front lines to spawn creep tumors. Swarm never rests. This next area is generally just like landed Vikings and stuff, right? I don't think I care. The Thor is going to be the part that I'm actually pretty concerned about. I th if, if it's a Thor up there, which it probably is. I'm actually going to throw down a save and I'm going to go over here. I don't know if this is a base. I know it's usually an orbital command and in Nightmare it was a base. So we'll see if it's a base on this one as well. Oh, it's base. Thank goodness. So this is worth it. Obviously, if it wasn't a base, I would have just reloaded to get my friends back. Yeah, both, uh... Oh, that's the Gorgon, too. Oh my goodness! This <laughs> was right about you, Kerrigan. You're a monster. You should have stayed in retirement, Warfield. We got it. Who asked you? Pull back. Yes. That's all I care about. Fully saturate this instantly. The swarm hungers. Go again. With it. Let's get this over with. Surround. Wow, those ghosts die quick. Oh, hello. Goodbye, my queen. Uh, let's just burrow right here as we spread the creep tumors. Out with it. Hopefully just making things safe for the whole family. You have my attention. Yeah, that's the way to stay safe here. 
We just have to make sure that we blast that Scourge Nest. I think we're going to be able to just go turbo fast soon. Like mega giga fast. Oh gosh. Oh, there's wraiths. The wraiths are pretty terrifying, actually. Let's uh, lead them over to the spores. This is fine. If they want to kill that, they can kill it. I have a lot of hatcheries for this reason. We really need to activate one of these so that I can keep moving. Oh, the spotlights are so sweet from the Gorgon. Oh, he's just, he's searching. I don't know if this is the best real scale mission, but it's, it's definitely one of the best. It's really high up there on the tier list for me. It's so cool. Okay, the Scourge are flying up. Do you ever regret working for a mass murderer? Do you ever regret being a mass murderer? Okay, we gotta go. Save these Zerglings, these Zerglings, and these Zerglings. We're gonna push into here next. Here with Kerrigans, we can get those bonus objectives. Please, no tanks in here. There's tanks in there. Nothing in there, though. That's great. Okay, this is mine. All of those are disabled. We can send a creep tumor up here, creep tumor over here. Try to move to the next Scourge Nest. Oh, they're starting to come back online, and I don't have the ability to Scourge them again. Oh, big damage from those Shockwave Missile Batteries. 150 kills. Oh my goodness. Okay. Shockwave Missile Batteries is a thing. Speak quickly. Fortunately, we have creep here, so I can get some spores. And fortunately, I have a lot of money. Because it turns out that three bases is a lot of bases. I think that the kids would call it based, because that's what that means, right? It's cool because you have a lot of bases. Jeez. Kill it now. Something's not working right with those projectiles. <laughs> I think it's like only if you're in the circle do you take damage from it, but they take a really long time to land. So if you don't stand in the circle, you're okay. There's 224 kill Banshee. Lots of bones in that trench. All Zerg. You'll join them soon enough. Okay, we did. It. We're doing great. Me, Warfield. You can't stop the swarm. Got to go. Oh. That's okay. We can beat that. Let's read it to humanity. Kill that. Char is mine, old man. Get out while you can. Get a strike team to oh, that store before the Zerg activate it. Oh, there's just a raven dropping auto turrets, and there's nothing I can do about it. The Thor is gonna die. Uh, Kerrigan, oh, Kerrigan died. I need that Kerrigan level. I mean, maybe I don't need that Kerrigan level. I like. I need a certain number of level for 
passives and stuff, but it's not like I need to get to level 70 or anything, right? So maybe it's okay. Oh, medics on hellbats. That's a bit of a spicy meatball. <laughs> He's trying to wall me in. <laughs> Why is you thermal here? What's going on? Oh, AI. Incredible. Why are there so many medics? Okay, Kerrigan, you need to get over to this bonus objective and then burrow. Zerglings, you need to tank for Kerrigan. Fine enough. Yeah, we're going to lose this base, I think. There's only one more Scourge Nest that we have to awaken. And fortunately, they're doing the four medic, one marine timing attack. Not sure what's up with that. Okay, these over here. Give her the opportunity to get in, and... Oh, we cleaned everything up there. Okay, we're fine. Kerrigan got all the bonus levels. Oh, I can't zoom again. Uh, do I have to redo this? There we go. The enemy in combat. The high cluster is under attack. <laughs> oh, that's so cool. We just have to protect the creep tumor as we spread it over. It's not too bad. We're playing Supreme Commander now. Oh, my spawning pool. Wait, do the spotlights give me vision to spread creep? Oh, no, they don't. That's a shame. Uh, I need to make sure that I have vision to spread creep, then. Did you miss me? That would have been really funny if the spotlights gave me spotting I needed. Keep building. Going after the overlords. Get him, Scourge. This is as far as I can I zoom. This planet in the name of the Terran Dominion. I'm not gonna lose it. Oh, I think you are. This is your last. I went okay. Isn't it? That went like legitimately okay. Oh, we're almost at ten thousand zerglings. Repeat, all dominion. Yeah. All righty. Old soldiers. Oh, we're not going to old soldiers, buddy. We're going to somewhere significantly more powerful. We are going you have to the evolution pit. Zergling. Let's upgrade some zerglings. Okay. get him. We'll check out the raptor statistics, make sure it adds two damage. I really hope it does. It does in the base game. I really need the damage. Are swarmlings good in real scale? Yes, but they're not, uh, they're not seven damage. Less lag leap. I forgot about that. Uh, in the original version of real scale, uh, right at the beginning, like, if you had, like, 200 zerglings leap, it would basically destroy your game. Oh, it would send it to jail, directly to jail, do not pass go, do not collect $200. Yeah, this is what we needed. 
I am a little bit afraid that the leap is going to cause me to lose a lot of stuff to splash damage. But what you gonna do? It's also going to allow me to kill splash damage sources, so I think that there's... There's a trade-off. Outpost destroyed. Next strain ready for testing. Yeah, I believe that swar in uh, real scale, the swarmlings are 15 per larva. They morph instantly, Light and I think they only take one supply instead of 1.5. I, I have no way to tell right there. If I wanted to pump up my numbers, I would go for swarmlings. But, I mean, it would pump up the numbers and never be able to overcome the armor of, like, a Thor. How strong is a Thor? Attackers eliminated. Ready to morph additional Zerglings. Destroy base. Yeah. <laughs> I definitely want Raptors. We fought against two of our greatest foes right there, the Siege Tank and the Thor, and the Siege Tank was much easier to deal with. Cool. Yeah, the Raptors are really more like uh, tanking and baneling things, you know. They're for Zergling utility more so than Zergling combat prowess. I like how we added casually another thousand Zerglings to the count in the span of like four minutes. Okay. Now we never care about this screen ever again. A new tier of abilities has awakened. If you wish to use Oh yeah, Zergling Reconstitution got changed. Uh Otherwise, That's going to be activate. That's going to be decent. That's going to be decent. It it's still got the spore crawler portrait <laughs> because it first Zergling Reconstitution was useless and then uh Orca changed it into improved crawlers. Which made Spore and Spine Crawlers OP. But he wanted to have uh, Zergling Reconstitution be in the game. And Improved Crawlers was super busted. And then he uh, changed it back. So we will see how this version is. Hopefully it's pretty good.